we beat a hell of a team, so I'm just excited about it. Yeah, I was just trying to, you know, I missed, first of all, I didn't shoot the first three uh, that I had opportunity to. And, um, you know, they called a timeout. Coach talked to me about it. And then, you know, the second time, you know, it was just another opportunity that happened. And I just took it, stepped up, and, you know, knocked it down. Virginia is a very, very, very tough team, and those guys just never gave up, man. You know, coming to this game, you know, Coach, you know, he told us that, you know, we, we better be ready uh, for a dog fight. I mean, that's what it was. And, uh, you know, like when they went on that run, uh, like I said before, we just never, we never lost our poise. Um, you know, we stayed together. We didn't point any fingers. Um, you know, we just stayed positive. And, you know, like I said, Virginia's a, you know, definitely a tough team, one of the tough teams we played, you know, all year. I give our guys a lot of credit. And we got in some foul trouble with Harris out, and that made it worse. But uh, this team, I think, learned through the adversity of what we dealt with when we had all the guys injured that uh, you got to just keep battling. As my football coach says, just stay the course. And we kind of stayed the course. And yeah, and I was disappointed. I thought in the first half we gave up some transition D just by not knowing who our men were. And yet I thought our half-court defense in general was maybe one of the best. You know, they shot 35 and 33, and that was with a couple of just complete mental mistakes. I thought once we were in the half-court, ours might have been as best as we've had in a long, long time, to be honest with you, since the Michigan game for sure.